Okay, this video is going to be about how to make um, a um, carburetor, if you can call it that, for a compressed air engine. The materials you need are a quarter inch ball valve, a coupler that fits the threads of that, a quick disconnect, this will connect to your air hose for your compressor. And this piece that screws on to there, this is how you'll connect it to the engine. Okay, um, and for tools, you need a 13th, 16th wrench for the ball valve. And I just use pliers to put these, the fittings in. Alright, we'll start with the coupler. Take your, oh yeah, I need a Teflon tape. I don't know if I said that before. Take your Teflon tape, wrap it around there. Oops. Okay. Just kind of put it on there. And then the um the way your valve um arm thing is facing when it's turned on. That's where your this is gonna go. So you take this and put it in finger tight. And take your wrench and pliers and screw it in there nice and tight. So a little bit difficult. Alright, so that's in there nice and tight. That's not going to go anywhere. Now, turn your valve to the closed position. It just makes things easier. And take your Teflon tape and wrap it around your quick connect fitting for your air compressor. And then turn that on. Like the other one, screw it in finger tight. Put the wrench on, put your pliers, and screw it in. Good. Tight. That should be good. Alright, that's how you make the actual carburetor. And how you connect this to the engine, you take a thing like this, really ju it's just a, a nut that'll match these threads, and um, you weld it onto your um, metal plate that bolts onto the intake port on your engine. So once you weld that on, you just screw in your carburetor, and then you can use this to control the speed and how much air goes into the engine. And that is how you make a compressed air engine carburetor. Thanks for watching. Bye.